Royals, what's going on? It's your girl Cutie Queen here, back with another video. Now, got another early, um, and you know what? February didn't feel that short to me. Um, felt just right. So now we in March, and yeah, that wasn't no good punchline, but y'all, but we in March. You know what comes with March in the sneaker world? I give y'all two seconds. That's right, Air Max month. So for all of my Air Max heads out there, I got a little something for you, okay? All right, so here is the box. It's actually, um, it's actually pretty, you know, not your just normal Air Max One box, because this is an Air Max One. Um, and yeah, we won't get into it, but kind of got a cut out here on the swoosh it's clear you'll be able to see it once we get into the box but you can kind of see inside just an appearance of it being like scraped up or aged and it's orange in that background um, it also has four clear circles here similar to the swoosh on top um, got your white nike logo on the back um, the back side you got the four cutout holes and clear white nike logo as well um, and uh, here are the details, baby. You see it. Nike Air Max 1 86 OG. Here we go. Pacaya. We got the Phantom and Summit White Air Max 1. Um, again, this is an 86 cut OG. Yeah, I like it. I like it. So, definitely, I would say first word texture. Okay, there is texture to this shoe, man, and and that's a great thing. A great, great thing. With this shoe, um, kind of has like a it, it has the summit white as per the description, of course. That phantom, I'm assuming, is more of the darker tone in there somewhere for my color warriors. Let's check it out. Um, so it is Summit White Phantom for my Latin friends. Blanc Summit Antome. You had to get Fantome. Blanc Summit Fantome. And on the upper here, as you can see. It is, this is not an illusion, okay? It is not an illusion. This is actually, it feels like rock. It feels like if I was holding a stone, right, and the stone had ridges, it would feel like that, kind of like a smooth stone. Um, that might be the best way I could describe it. Um, it has the color of what could be like, uh, you know, the tile textures that people use on like the kitchen counters, but it's textured though, right? So anyway, it has that all over the upper. Um, as you can see, the swoosh is a solid sort of cream color. That Summit White, I'm assuming. That lateral side has the same, much of the same. Back heel, Nike Air, in all white, sewn on there. Tongue, kind of a suede uh, or suede texture, something white color. Also is mainly white, kind of sort of looks like it has a light gray toward the toe and toward the heel. Looks like we got a little description on the insole here. You can see, it says something about Tinker Hatfield. Let me read it and then uh, I'll show it again. So Tinker Hatfield, born 1959, Nike Air Max 1986, Duramesh, synthetic suede on air sole unit. The Air Max is a shoe with visible Nike air unit. Okay. And so it just kind of gives you the birth of Tinker, who is the designer of the Air Max, as we all know, um, in 1986. So, okay. Okay, so the other shoe has, please do not step on the arch. Okay. So, that's that. So, it has, a, it has some unique 
Easter eggs in here, or not even Easter eggs, because it's blatant, the, the insole is pretty blatant, but it has something a little different than your normal Air Max one, okay? Um, trying to see if I, I can identify anything else that's different per se. Um, I will say on the midsole, the midsole is textured as well. Feels like paint up against um, a wall that wasn't necessarily uh, drywalled first. <laughs> If that makes sense. <laughs> no, my descriptions is crazy right now, but um, yeah, this is definitely that whole please do not step on the art piece. Um, it definitely has an art feel. At first, when I first pulled the shoe out, I was gonna say a canvas feel. I was gonna say that. So now that I read that, I want to go back and take my stone um, description away and go more with. Uh, a piece of art that has texture on it, texture on the canvas, um, and painted ever so perfectly to give you a specific pattern um, that is the outcome of the shoe, man. So, super dope. So, I saw a March 9th drop for these for $170, okay? So, these right here, man. These are definitely clean. If you're looking for something that's different, like a different Air Max to pick up, because it's been a while since we got anything fun as far as Air Max month, right? So, and that's not to say this one is, is you know, out of this world per se, but it, it just feels different. It feels different, and that's kind of what we all have been waiting for. And uh, we got it, man. Here you go. March 9th, what y'all gonna do? Hit me in the comment section. Let me know if you've been looking at these. Um, let me know if this is something that's interesting to you. Um, I will say, definitely a functional color. Um, definitely not too loud and crazy. You could do multiple things with it. Um, you could do the casual look with it. You could do the sporty look with it. Yeah, man. It's nice. It's nice. So, again, that's it for the vid, man. Y'all let me know what y'all thinking. And until next time, royalty. <laughs>